What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to see you guys again. I hope you had an amazing Christmas and I hope you're having an amazing holidays as you're watching this. So if you have been a long time subscriber like some of you guys have, I'm doing a what I got for Christmas 2022 video. I've done it a few times and you guys always love seeing uh, the things that I got for Christmas. I love being able to show you guys what I got and see if you guys got the same things or even inspiration for things that you're going to buy for yourself. If you've never seen my face before, welcome to my channel. My name is Savannah and I'm so glad that you're here. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you love this video because I love you guys and I just want to keep growing this family with you all. Without further ado, let's get into this video today. I'm excited to show you guys what I got for Christmas. Okay guys, let's get into it. I decided the first set of stuff I'm going to do is some of the clothes that I got. I did get a bunch of clothes this year, which is probably a good thing. I have too many clothes. A few of the things that I got were some really cute jeans. I love like a baggy, like ripped jean. And these ones I got from my mom. These are American Eagle. They fit really, really nice, guys. And they're kind of like a skinnier like foot at the bottom. They're not as boot cut or baggy but they're still super nice so cute I really like them and then I also got some low rise because low rise is coming back y'all I love me a nice pair of low rise jeans and again they're just like denim washed color really cute I needed more jeans because I love wearing jeans <laughs> and then I got this really 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 cute um dress and it's almost like a pleather type fitted like dress it doesn't have sleeves and it has this like really cute zipper at the back i think it just makes it look really classy really elegant but also kind of like sexy which i really like my mom got me this dress actually and i'm not sure where she got it the brand is retrod if anyone retroid if anyone knows what that brand is but yeah, definitely my favorite. I can't wait to find somewhere to wear this to. This is so cute. Last thing I got in terms of like clothes and stuff or just like outfits was just a pair of AF1s. Um, the basic white ones, of course. My mom only got me these sneakers <laughs> because I steal hers. I have a pair, but mine are high rise. And she had the low top ones and I wore them like probably like twice. And so she was like, no, I'm getting you your own. And <laughs> that's what I opened up on Christmas. Before we move on from like gifts that my parents got me, the last thing they got me was a speaker. Um, this one is just like a Mercury, like a typical speaker. It sounds amazing. I used it the other night when... Oh, just turned on. I used it the other night when my friends were over and we had like kind of like a game night Christmas dinner party type thing. And it sounds amazing. This was definitely something that I needed and I'm glad I got. I almost forgot one more thing that my parents did get me. And it was this game called Bad Choices. <laughs> if you guys want to start drama with your friends or your family, like definitely get this game because it is hilarious. But it is also so shady. Um, so basically my friends and I played this. And the objective of the game is like you have a bunch of cards with like a choice on it and they're not always like good things, you know, they're kind of questionable, a little bit inappropriate and you basically have to ask the person that you think would say yes to that choice. So that's what I mean by being a little bit shady because you know your friends better than most people, right? So you'll be able to give them cards that you know go with them and they have to say yes if it's true. And your goal is to get rid of all your cards. But yeah, super fun. Uh, I played it twice now with two different groups of friends. And I've already gone through like most of the deck, I think. Because we just kept playing round after round. So this was a really good gift. We're going to move on to other things that I got from my friends and my boyfriend. And I'm super excited to show you guys some of the gifts that my friends got me. Because 
they just they just we did so well for each other and I was so happy with everything that I received from them so the first couple things that I wanted to show that I got from both of my friends um, was this book it starts with us by Colleen Hoover uh, if you're a Colleen Hoover fan tap in I loved it ends with us and my best friend Tia who I loaned it ends with us too got me the second book for me to read and I'm so excited because I really wanted to read this book and my other best friend Chanel she got a gift that went with the book and it's a night like a little book reader for like a night you stick it in your book and then the light shines onto your pages this is something that I'm definitely gonna use and I love how they got like something that kind of coordinated with each other my friends and I got each other a lot of like self-care kind of like chill soft girl life gifts for each other for Christmas and I think that speaks volumes about our friend group <laughs> because we each got each other things that were like similar in that kind of category it is literally one of those um I haven't even taken it out of the package yet because I've been waiting to film this video one of those face rollers I'm taking it out for y'all like look how cute this is and the color of it are you crazy and then a matching, um, I think this, what do they call these? I don't want to mispronounce it, but the stuff that you use to like, you know, sculpt your face. Uh, I've wanted one of these for a while and I love sage green, so this is perfect. More things that I'm definitely going to be using. I already have these out of the package because I've already started using them before I filmed. But these are those little things you put when you're washing your face and you know that awful feeling of the water like dripping down no baby that's not gonna happen that's not gonna happen this is another gift from one of my besties Chanel and then this of course is just to keep your hair back when you're washing your face as well I'm pretty sure that she got these off of Sheen so if you are looking for something like this definitely go on Sheen you can I'm sure you could get like a package that is matching in whatever color you like too to the next gift which is literally amazing and something I actually needed Tia got me a sheet set a gold sheet set because like I said soft girl life luxury like my friend group knows what's good feels so nice I can't wait to use these on my bed and I actually needed more sheet sets and I was talking to my mom about it the other day and she got me some onto more of these gifts I got an exfoliating towel and a soft bristle body brush so if you have never heard of dry brushing girl you need to look it up so this is the brush that she got me as you guys can see it's just like a normal brush but it has a handle because you're supposed to use it like this onto your body actually dry brushing helps like promote blood like to certain parts of your body it also helps like remove dry skin dead skin and it's just an old old practice that a lot of cultures use you know just to keep their skin glowing healthy and not just like your face like your whole body and it's a part of a lot of beauty routines for people it's just like another step in that soft girl life like you know i totally forgot to show you guys this which also came from my mom it's like a headband and it's gorgeous i've already worn it I feel like headbands can add that extra oomph of like, you know, classiness to an outfit. I love headbands, like, if you know, you know. And it's just giving Blair Waldorf, you know, and that's what I always want to be giving. The last gift uh, that I got from one of my besties was this Clinique. It came in a little box thing, but I already took it off. And it comes with, inside, the Clinique Take the Day Off Cleansing Balm, which I love I use this as part of my double cleansing I do this and then I'll do like an oil cleanser and then a normal like soapy cleanser or I'll just do this and my soap cleanser a facial soap which is you know to wash your face with and a makeup remover like a micellar water type vibe I have never used these two products but I'm excited to see how they work last set of gifts are all for my boyfriend and I can't wait to show you guys the cool things that he got me the first gift that he got me was the five minute journal I have never heard of this journal until he I unwrapped it obviously and it's literally amazing so basically it's a journal that gives you like it says here tools to positively change your life so every day is a new like prompt of some sort 
about gratitude, um, how it works, the morning routine, the night routine, and it's really just to like kind of like inspire you, allow you to get your, you know, emotions out on paper. We can read it like it asks you to put like how you're feeling today, your daily like gratitude stuff, which is really cool. I love to write in a journal and he knows that. So he got me something that would make it easier for me, but also have some really good like insight and motivational stuff. It's from intelligentchange.com if you want to get your own. The second thing that he got me that I haven't used yet, but I'm definitely going to use after I'm finished filming this video because I've been so excited since I unwrapped it, um, was this Everyday Mindfulness gift set. As you can see, there's a theme in my gifts. And it is a Zen garden, but it's a create your own Zen garden. So this is the back of it. Like that explains like what it is essentially. And it comes with, you know, the paper, a calligraphy brush and ink, um, a book that tells you like how to do it properly and like just helpful methods to achieve like mindfulness in daily life with yoga, meditation, stuff like that. And just stuff that is like stress relieving, which I love that because this year has been super stressful and I really appreciate him getting something that, you know, will help alleviate that stress. Lastly, another thing he got me was these starry lights. As you can see, they're like string lights. I have some up in my room right now, but these ones are gonna be used for when I start to set up my table for like all my youtube stuff and where i'm going to be filming just to add that little extra pizzazz honorable mention for the sweater because i also got this for christmas but as you can see i'm already wearing it it's so soft and so cute this was for my mom as well but that is it for this year's 2022 what i got for christmas video i hope you guys enjoyed watching i hope you saw some things that you might have liked let me know if we got matching gifts at all leave a comment below on what your favorite gift was this year or something that you gave someone that was your favorite thing this year i can't wait to read your responses and i hope you guys have an amazing rest of 2022 and i will see you guys in 2023 bye Passing up on my own ways, I can't blame you.